<laughs> we're both pretty weird. Yeah. <laughs> I like that, don't you? <laughs> That's why we're friends. <laughs> That's true. Uh. <laughs> don't embarrass me too much. You too. Hey! How was it coming to the Mount? Finding your people, meeting new friends in the freshman year? So I came to Mount and I knew some girls from my grade school who were also coming. It was important for me to make sure that I didn't stay in my grade school bubble. I wanted to branch out, meet new people that had similar interests as me. And so I did that through, um, you know, field hockey. And then through the activities fair, I also was able to meet people who were interested in the same clubs as I was. And so it made it really easy to find friends and find new people that I knew I would connect with. So I live an hour away, so I didn't know anyone coming into the Mount or anyone really living down here or, or anything. So it was a little nerve wracking at first, but when you come in, you notice that a lot of people don't know anyone and it's not that awkward. People are very like nice and welcoming and everyone else is nervous with you. So it's easy to fit in real quick. It's really interesting because I came into school, I had about seven girls coming from my grade school, so I knew people, but honestly, some of my best friends and the people that I've become the closest with are people that I just met organically through clubs or just walking around the hallways. So it's actually, I'm not to be cliche, but it's really easy to make friends because everyone's just looking to be kind and like they see a freshman walking in the hall, someone's gonna stop you and say hi and introduce themselves. Even if you don't stay friends with the girls that were at your grade school, there's so many new faces around that are all looking to do the same thing, which is make friends and get involved is my piece of advice. You know, you meet friends through sports, through clubs, in your classes, just try to be kind to everyone you encounter because they're all looking to make friends too. I knew like no one else here, no one else from my grade school came. I didn't really have any friends just because it is a bit further from my house. But then I was like, okay, like, I know this is gonna be the best place for me academically. And I think there's a thousand clubs, a thousand sports that I can get involved in. So I was like, okay, like I'll go for it. So when I came to the Mount, like, obviously I was shy, a little bit nervous, but I had no issue making new friends. Coming from a public school was definitely different. I joined sports teams, um, like cross country. It started before school started. And so there I met like some people, got to know them. And then once school started, I had a few friends. One of the first places I made friends was at um, the freshman picnic. And then I met those girls again once school started and I hung out with them and I'm still friends with them today, as well as also, like she said, joining crew and running and all those fun things. I would definitely say the Disney trip really helped guide me into my friend group. I felt like I really got to know people through the trip especially my roommates. I really was able to get close with them. I knew a few of them from crew and other sports, and I met some of them through some of my other friends. And I was able to meet people on the trip that I've never knew before. I met most of my friends through um, my classes, especially my lunch period. That's where I made my first best friends. And then um, they just carried out into the clubs and the sports that I did. And then, especially the Disney trip, I met some of my best friends on that one. I just tried to talk to everyone and see who like I was kind of like leaning towards. So that was... That's, yeah, that's how it happened. <laughs>